Hi, everyone, and welcome. Thank you for being here today. I was asked to share a little bit with you about nitric oxide and osteophonic tuning forks. And first of all, let me explain to you a little bit about osteophonic tuning forks. Osteo means bone, osteophonic. Tuning forks resonate with body tissue. A body tuner has weights on the end, something that I can hear quite loudly, but you may not be able to hear, right? The reason why you may not be able to hear a body tuner is because the vibration here on the energy tuner, the vibration is going out. So it's traveling out to your ears. It's traveling out to your energy field. Whereas a body tuner has weights on it, the vibration, instead of going out, is redirected back down the fork through the stem so that you can actually feel the vibration not only here in your ears as you hear it, but you can feel it here on your body. When you feel it here on your body, it creates a vibration that will vibrate the tissue in your bone, in your muscle, and on acupressure points, wherever you happen to put the stem. So that's the definition of an osteophonic tuner. Now this particular osteophonic tuner, colored red, matches the red here. This red tuning fork is called Oot, UT, and it has a vibrational frequency of 396 hertz. This one here, if we were to put weights on that 396 tuner, we wouldn't be able to get the same effect that we want. So we take 396, we cut it in half, and we have to cut it in half again to get 99 hertz. At 99 hertz, we are now able to put weights on it and direct the weight back down into the stem so that we can feel the vibration. Now, within a certain range, that is possible. And I refer you now to research done by Dr. Beaulieu, who uh, determined that sound, whether you are hearing music or sound frequencies, very specific ones, solfeggio frequencies, have an effect on the body. Now you may have heard on some of the other videos or some other research that is out there that music can help you feel a certain way. There are music frequencies that resonate with you, help you to relax, perhaps, or increase your energy to help you feel happy or more energized. And then there are frequencies of music, types of music that kind of grate against you or are not harmonious with you, make you, don't, make you not feel good. For me, I know what that kind of music is. You probably know too. And you know what kind of music you like. Music that feeds your soul. Yeah? And we have discovered that certain frequencies feed our soul. They harmonize with the body. And if we take those frequencies, as Dr. Boyu says, if we take those frequencies and apply them to our environment, whether in our energy field or to our physical body, it has a physiological effect on the body. The cells in your body like that. How do they like it? Let me demonstrate. If everybody will just follow directions, I'm gonna say the directions first, and then I'll say them again where you can actually follow along. All right, so I would, when I tell you to close your eyes, inhale, kind of feel how you feel when you inhale, hold it just for a second, let it go, exhale. All right, so this time, close your eyes, inhale, pause, exhale. What happened to your shoulders on the exhale? Yeah, they dropped, you relaxed, right? And on the inhale, did you feel kind of a tension almost? Yeah? All right. 
your cells breathe like this too. Research has shown that your cells actually do something called puffing. They breathe in response to sound energy, in response to vibration, they breathe. And they're breathing nitric oxide. They're producing nitric oxide when they are relaxed. The nitric oxide made by the cells comes out of the, out of the cells, bathing the cells in an environment that causes them to relax. Relaxed means your muscles relax. Relaxed means your heart relaxes. Your, your emotions relax when your cells are producing nitric oxide. Now this is a big deal, right? Nitric oxide, one atom of nitrogen combining with one atom of oxygen to form a very simple compound that science is saying is pretty miraculous. Now, how do we use that? You can't buy it at the store. You're not going to get a bottle with a label on it. You're not going to do that. This is how you're going to get nitric oxide. so simple. Where would you put that stem on the body if you knew where to put it? Well, there's a whole practice around that. Acupuncture practice has studied the Chinese meridians, has studied acupressure, acupuncture points in the body. What do you do when you have a headache? Do you ever rub your temples? perhaps? Or what do you do if your elbow hurts? Do you ever rub your elbow? You might be doing acupressure. And there are points on the body that can be stimulated that if you massaged it or if you pressed could cause relief. Now what if you could take it up a notch? What if you could do that? and apply a specific vibrational frequency at a point that could use it, a trigger point. Perhaps you have something going on where this particular point would make a difference. I can feel that all through my ear canal. Anybody having any ear issues or head issues? There are many resources available to you Potent Points book, even apps on the phone where you can look up potent points, acupressure points, where you can be provided with some direction on where to place the stem on the body. Now you may find that the point is directly where you feel like you need it. Just like when you have a headache, you want to massage your temples. It may not be where you think it is. Maybe the point is on your foot and it will affect somewhere else in the body. So I encourage you to look at resources available to you to discover where that might be that you would have the most benefit for using these osteophonic tuners. Now by definition, in research that Dr. Bo Yu did, the tuning fork he used was a 128 hertz. We have this one, <laughs> pardon me, at 99. We have an ohm tuner at 136.1 hertz. And there's actually a whole series of tuning forks, all the colors of the solfeggio forks that we have as energy tuners also exist as body tuners. And in using the body tuners, they're all osteophonic. They all will be felt as a vibration in bone, in muscle, in joints, in points, anywhere you would like to try. Number one thing to remember is you're not hurting anything. The number two thing is it might help. If it doesn't hurt and it might help, then this is another tool in your pocket 
that you can use for greater health and vitality. Nitric oxide may be the miracle that we have all been looking for that does not come in a bottle with a label. They come in a box with Soma Energetics on the label. Thank you so much for your kind attention.